Hi, I'm Anna. And I'm Megan, and welcome to Wing Creativity Knox. We're here with our guest again, the lovely Cindy <laughs> Bassan. How are you? Just ducky. <laughs> We've been doing <laughs> rain gutter, little uh, rubber ducky rain gutter races all day here at Makers I can't even Fair. Talk about it. I'm so <laughs> over rubber ducky duck. Race. It's been really a lot of fun, but it's really windy today, so we decided to move Cindy on inside the trailer, and we're going to do a great little project. What you got in store for us? It's quick, and it's simple, and it's great to mail to relatives um, with pictures inside, so I've been repurposing You're again. You're so serious. You know, I mean, She's serious. so serious about this. She's like, <laughs> we're going to get it in, get it out. Get out. Go. I'm repurposing again. Okay. Um, empty CD case. Nice. Like it? <laughs> Isn't it attractive? It's so lovely. And the inside oh. just pops out. Hey. Oh, so what do we do? We just get rid of that? Yep. We don't need oh. this. Why? We throw it away. Because That's we don't right. need that Let's pop. just throw things <laughs> at people, Anna. <laughs> there we go. We're off okay. to a good start. Okay. Um, I'm using the Henry's Brilliance line from Nikki's Sybil's Scrapbooker really? Papers. She has yeah. the cutest assortment of papers and stamps and brads and all kinds of cutesy stuff. Because you know owls are very in right now. Yes. And we're doing a little back to school or, or school memories book for my boys from oh, this cute. year. So I measured out two hey, pieces, <laughs> two We're pieces that are care of mommy. four and three quarters by five and a quarter. Two pieces. I measured them out and then cut them and just back to back them. Okay. You glued them back to back. I just glued them back to back, back okay. to back them with my Elmer's Craft glue stick. And that is for the top. Okay. Are you done with these? Yes. Do they have, is there little way. notches? Oops, I'm not putting that there yet. Okay. I'm, I'm lying to you. It's okay. Then Psych I just, you know, sight, sight. <laughs> <laughs> it was too plain this way. So I cut a little piece um, out of another coordinating paper. Oh, okay. And I just glued that on. Spice it up? Yeah, just glued that right on there. Yeah. There you go. This is very cute. It's the cutest line of papers. It's cute colors. I like the graphics and everything. Good work, girl. Good designs. And then I tucked it in here. So there. literally like you're putting a CD. Yep, you're like you're putting a CD. Okay. It really does fit when you... Okay. Take the time to do it right. And then, <laughs> I'm like, us, we're just like, you know, why would we take the time to do anything right here? And then we cut two more squares of coordinated okay. pattern paper that are. Are you doing the back side? Yeah, for the back side. Okay. That are four and three quarters by five. Okay. Don't worry about measurements, I'll be on our website. Yeah, it'll all be on the website. Glue those back to back. Mm -hmm. okay. Again, wanted a little something extra. Okay. So I cut out the little owls from the front. Mm hmm. And I just layered them on the back. Okay. And tucked that in underneath these little plastic tabs. Yeah, that one's easier because you have the little things that slide it in. Yeah. So there you've got your front and your back. Okay. Now what? And then it comes you together. Know it. Now what? Now what? Now what? Two strips that are eight and three quarters by two inches. Okay. Any kind of cardstock, coordinating paper, doesn't matter. Okay. And you're going to mountain and valley fold, fold them. What did you just call me? Mountain and valley fold them, or accordion <laughs> fold them. Thank you. We measured up about two and a half, two and a quarter inches, give or take a little bit, and went ahead and glued down. Each side? Yes, okay. just glue them down. So it's actually going over the hinge yep, on the actually, case, it's going the right jewel over case. That hinge. Got it. Okay. Okay. Then I measured out eight because I made enough sides for eight. You could add more if you uh -huh. made the fold smaller. You could put mm -hmm. in a whole bunch of pictures, but I just traced them out on the coordinating papers. I'm course. sorry, what size did you say they were? These? Yeah. Whatever the size of your image is, right? A little bit bigger than your image. Oh, okay. <laughs> because, see, like, not all of your pictures are always going to be the same. Oh, okay. You could do the same thing with a single sheet of the, of the core. Oh, you got you. Okay. Solid, you know, like I, I, four by six, five by seven. I got you. Cut down or okay. whatever. Three and a half by fives. And, um. No exact science here, guys. No, it, there mm -hmm. really isn't. It's just keep it simple. Okay. Okay, I'm going to take and this And what, before you do that, what are we doing with these? We're going to glue these to the front. Of each of these mountains. Of each of our mountains. Ooh. Ooh. Not valleys. Ooh. Yes, you glue it to the front. Turn that around. Glue okay. it to the front of the mountains. And just, I alternated the, the patterns. Okay. Which you'll okay. be able to see on the finished one. Okay. Um, I wanted to put a little embellishment in. If you're going to put inside embellishments, it has to be flat things. Stickers, rub-ons, rubber mm -hmm. stamp, images, something like that. These little slide mounts. Okay. I used one of those. But let's move on. I'll show you this okay. one. Okay. Great. And then you would just... Go back to you just glue your little photo. There's Thomas's third grade picture. Okay. Um, onto that. Such okay. a little weasel. <laughs> so cute. 
Um, I put a little ribbon on the outside. Cute. It just pulls off. If you're mailing, you won't put the ribbon. Yeah, if you want to mail it, you want it to be completely flat, okay. then it will fit in one of those little manila envelopes oh, easily. Oh, right. And okay, it's got white, it. so it doesn't cost a lot to mail it. Oh, look at this. Oh, how cute. And I just added a little bit more of the decorative paper trims. Uh -huh. Can you close it again and open it Jazzed again? it up a little bit. What, you like the pop-up book effect? Jazzed I do. Like the <laughs> oh, very, very cute. Some very of their cute. cardstock stickers and one of the little owls I put on there. Oh, and really I just, cute. It's my you've boys. you repeated the ribbon. Yep, I repeated inside. a little bit of the ribbon inside. Mm -hmm. My boys and their best friends, just school memories from this year. That's cute. Could you show, share some of your other ideas too? Because yeah. these are really cute. This one, um, again, if you're going to embellish it, I wanted to add a little bit of razzmatazz, but you can't use depth. So. Razzmatazz. <laughs> I'll, take that over, like that? I'll take that over just plain pizzazz. <laughs> so I'm not going to complain. I'll let you rock with that. Go ahead. Um, I used some fine glitter. You know, some it looks like dazzles. pop rocks. It does kind of look like pop rocks, yeah. Oh my gosh, I haven't had those in so And long. some actual colored sand. And uh -huh. um, embellished one of the butterflies from Nikki Sybil's paper just to kind of give mm -hmm. it a little bit more. Some Rick Rack. These are her brads. I cut the now, brads off. Now, the brads are on the outside. They're on the outside. Okay. Yes, so I cut the backs off and glued those on. We, um, we want some ooh ahs. Ooh ahs. Uh. Oh, I'm just thinking about pop rocks. Yet. But th that's okay because you could. Yeah. You know. But you could do general ones like this. You mm -hmm. could do a Halloween one. It would be you should do all pictures of me. Oh, well, I should. <laughs> this would be good for you. Look, does, it's your colors. <laughs> Megan, through the years. Let's look uh, at the. Let's look at uh, your other ones too. This is a Christmas too, one great. that I embellished with some more bedazzles and a little bit of glitter. We're doing a lot of weddings in our neighborhood right now. Yeah, so that'd be, be really great fun. little quick and easy things for mm -hmm. that. This is your first one you did. This is the this. first one, yeah, that I that I did initially um, for my son's Joseph's first year of baseball. That's really cute. And I noticed you used, on this one you used a different color cardstock, yep. not the white. Yep. I just you can use anything; it doesn't matter. It was just coordinate, and I added some really stickers cute. and ribbons and a little bit of text because you've got mm -hmm. space for anything. But you really, really can do solid pictures. That's but they cute. hold tight. They snap closed. I like Very the little letter. In the little letter. Yeah. Initial, so you can personalize them, and this is yeah, really a lot of fun. You could write it in the owl's belly. We thought we should have we googly eyes. eyes. We, we forgot the googly eyes. I can't handle you guys. I can't. I quit. Oh my Everything gosh. Everything is better with googly eyes. This is a really <laughs> cute project, Cindy. And you know, it's super simple. Yep and recyclable and then adding something new with something old which we love to do here at when creativity knocks open I'm gonna the end before you give me googly eyes you know what we always say when creativity knocks <laughs> open, open the, the door, door. <laughs> this is really cute mm -hmm.